After securing over 40,000 points and completing over two thirds of the tasks in the entire game, there's only around 1,200 tasks and we've already done over 800, we are now in the race and contention for rank one. I need a scythe. It's gonna speed up all of the end goal tasks significantly, including the theater of blood itself. We're gonna be doing a mixture of different tasks today as well as Tob whenever we can. Purples are a one in three with the boosted drop rates and one out of nine for a specific person. So let's get the show on the road. Somehow we're still gonna be dry. Oh, Grandmaster task, yeah, let's go. Actually, need me one of those. Okay, so I'm gonna go to purple. GL, GL. Oh, a Linguini staff. A Linguini staff. Not a fan. Let's fucking go, dude. It was a Grandmaster. Yeah, that's 24 out of 30. That's 24 out of 30. Since combat achievements have came out, a lot of the high point tasks come from completing a certain amount of milestones and completing a certain number amount of combat achievements. For example, 10, 20, 30, etc. Grandmaster combat achievements. So I'm trying to bang them out whenever I can. Oh shit, a purple, a purple. -y. Good luck, good luck. Bro, what's wrong? Why is everyone playing on my downfall, bro? Here I am trying to see people win. What's going on? I was MVP as well. Like, what's going on? That. Yeah, stop right there. What's that? In my opinion, the hardest task in the entire league is the speedrun time for the Hallowed Sepulchre, or as I call it, the Halloween Sepulchre. You need to do every single floor almost perfectly to achieve a time under 6 minutes 30. I learned this entire thing last league, and it probably took me over 15 hours to achieve the time. This time around, I tried getting it while achieving 99 agility and was unsuccessful, as you guys might have seen in my last video. However, I didn't want to waste too much time on it, but I said I would do an attempt here and there whenever there was some free time in between tops. To get the time you need to complete the entire run, you need to have 3 minutes, 30 seconds left on the clock in the top left. Let's fucking go, boys. Wait. No way I don't get there and fucking... No way I don't get there. Four, three, two, one. Oh my god, I literally did it with one second ago, bro. Let's go, boys. Let's go. I'm so gassed. I literally just ordered some food. I was just doing a couple runs, seeing if I was getting mad or not. See if I could get it done. And we fucking did it, boys. We did it literally with one second to spare, but I do not care. 
I do not care. Let's go, dude. 629, that's 125 league points right there. Did not miss doing that. Obviously, it took us way less time than it took us last time, but hey, we're done. All right, let's do this thing. I'm going for the five kills without taking any special damage, bro. Surely we can do it this time. I'm literally bringing a Ferocious Gloves, Barrow's Gloves switch because I'm in minus 67 mage bonus, so I actually splashed the Crumble Undead. I literally just did a 20 second kill. Oh my god. Okay, and we finally got Vorkat's head because we're at 50 KC, and I still... Where is it? Where is he? Where is the Vorkath head? Oh, he's right there, and I still have not got the thing without taking special damage. I'm trying right now, but I'm mauled in hard, man. Let's fucking go, dude. Defeat Vorkath five, five, defeat Vorkath five times without special damage. Master Combat Toss, dodging the dragon as well. 125 league points, 51 KC, and we finally got it done, bro. I was not having fun, bro. I'd get so close, and my path thing, like, my brain just stops working, bro. I'm just so happy I've got that done. Get an Ava's Assembler real quick, 50 league points like that, shout out my boy Vorkath. Actually, I hate you, but 41.575k points now. Just been chilling here for a little bit, got the Zamorak Monk bottom and the Monk top, which means I can use a full Zami set with Zamorak in sight, which means I can go to Zora and get some fast as fuck kills. Should be a good time. Let's go, that's 3 out of 10 Krakens. Alright, we have a very, very nice setup to go do Zora with. We have the full Zami switch as well. I can't even one take a six way anymore. I really am a washed up PK. -er. But basically with the Zamoroki and Might, wherever you are. Where are you? Zamoroki and Sight. Oh, my bad. Um, when four in oh, I clicked the Sar one. When we're in four Zamorak items, you have 250% increased magic. I also have chain magic on, uh, which gives me 60% chance of doing another attack roll. It's just some it's just a very good uh, it's just a very good set, very good gear. And I should be able to do some Zalbra Casey very, very quickly. I already have 50. I am hunted the Tanzanite Fang and the Magic Fang. And yeah, we should be able to go do some fun shit after that. Found a pretty good setup for Zalra. I forgot to bring my Book of the Dead for Thralls, but yeah, this one I'm rocking. Maybe I'll bring a Boot Switch too, or maybe I won't use these boots because it does give me some negative mage bonus, yeah. Damn, my second Serp Visage. I already have a, what's it called? I already have a Serpentine Helm. That could have been the Fang. That could have been the, well, it could have been either the Fangs, the Magic Fang or the Tanzanite Fang. Not really a big deal. I'd have to do 250 Zalras and 500 Zalras anyway, but I would like to get the Blowpipe and shit sooner rather than later. I've got the 9-2 Curse, bro. I just got an Uncut Onyx. Same drop rate as a Tans. Same drop rate as the Magic Fang. GG. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Tanzanite Fang, 98 KC. That's the Blowpipe. I'm gassed, bro. That's actually really good for us. That is so nice. That is so good, bro. Let's go make this right now. There we go. Craft the Toxic Blowpipe. 125 league points. 41.7k. Ooh, we go to Hard Combat Toss. Zulra Adept. I think that's 100kc. Oh my god, I just got a 031. New personal best. Jesus Christ, this shit's quick. Let's go, the Magic Fang. We've completed Zulra in 115kc. Absolutely take that. Let's go make this piece. Hundos. Use the Magic Fang. Oh, I need a chisel. Uh, no, let's use this on that. How do you do this? You get the Raft the Fang onto the Trident. Toxic Trident completed. 125 League Points. 41,825 League Points. I actually don't know what to do, bro. I wasn't expecting to complete it this early. Genuinely don't have a plan of action, bro. I wasn't expecting to complete Zora that quickly. I'm guessing we're just going to go finish off 750 Zora KC while I try and think of what to do. I could go do Arma, Sara, and Zami. Uh, I could go do a lot of things. I am once again three hitting Kraken. This is not as chill as I'm gonna imagine, huh? I'm gonna finish the 750 KC real quick. Oh my god. Let's go, another trident. I've been seeing a lot of comments saying you guys think I'm on Adderall or something keeping me up for this leagues. Now I want to clear something up. The only thing I'm getting high off right now is you guys subscribing. 50% of you guys watching right now aren't even subbed and if you really want to see me cooked off my head, click that sub button. Subscribers are the only thing I'm snorting this league. And this is 750 Kraken KC. That is all the Kraken KC toss that there is. If I get seven Kraken tentacles or whatever, seven more Kraken tentacles, in fact, I can enhance a, a trident. And that's a master task for 250 points. But for now, that is all the Kraken KC. Another uh, 125 league points for defeating the Kraken boss 750 times. We're now 41,950. Let's get this loot and get out of here. And that is 25 million Fletching XP. We're over 42,000 points now. 42,075. I think that's one of our first 25 mils. Obviously, we got like fishing and cooking and all shit like that. But Fletching, very quick and easy. Obviously, I just did some of the bank now. Don't roast me in the comments. I did most of it efficiently, all right? Okay, I just got the Dragon Chain Body. I think it's 125 points to wield this bad boy. Yeah, it is. 42,200 points. We absolutely take that. 15 KC. We want to get the... What's it called? We want to get the D2H as well. That's very, very nice for us. 42.2K. And that is my second Dragon Chain Body, 31 KC. I'm looking for that Warhammer. The Warhammer, the sword. You can tell I'm sleep deprived. The D2H or the KQ head. All right, this is a hard combat achievement done for 50 KC at uh, KQ. Calphite Queen Adept. Third Dragon Chain Body, 57 KC. 
And that is 100 KQ. Oh, no KQ head and Dragon 2H in the same fucking drop. That is unfortunate. But 100 cow fight queen kills 100 times. I'll probably come back when I have a scythe or something. Probably don't want to camp it out with just mage, even though it is a pretty good tactic. It does go pretty quickly. But we're now on 42,325 points. And that is my 100th Slayer toss completed. What the hell? I didn't even know that. That's 50 points right there. That's my 29th Jad as well. I only have to do one more to not know that was going to be a 50 pointer right there. 42,375 little combo breaker, huh? Now, I'm just gonna go do a melee one for my final one, because I think that is a combat achievement. Fuck, how do I do a melee jet again? Uh... Fuck. I'm panicking. Bro, am I gonna out-DPS these healers or what? What about his shit, fab? Fuck it, dude. I'm taking my prayer off. Oh, fuck! <laughs> I have a gun, he can still melee me. Good fight. And that is complete the fight caves 30 times as well as an elite combat task facing Jad head on. Another 125 elite points. Just gonna go gamble all the fire caves I've had. I did die a couple times, so I didn't get every single one. But hey, let's go gamble them all now. See if we can get the Jad pet. Bro, legit, where's the fucking, uh, where's the Jad pet at? What's going on? What a troll, dude. Sorry, I'll get the Zuck pet, I'm sure. Last one, last one of this season. Can we get it? Nope, GG. That is punching Vorkath to death, which is a Grandmaster combat task, the Fremenic way. Now I just need to do one without losing any prayer points. Uh, should be an interesting one. And that is defeat Vorkath without using any prayer potions, which is the Grandmaster task, Faithless Encounter. Bro, how's this thing still coming for me? What? I still have to do one more, damn. I thought that was, uh, I thought that was my 20th one, interesting. And that is 20 Grandmaster combat achievements completed. I just went and did a gauntlet real quickly with only a tier 3 weapon and one tier 1 staff. Can we get a second enhanced crystal seed for the culture? No, we cannot, but we got some crystal shards, which is good. That's another 125 league points for 20 Grandmaster combat tasks. We're now at 42,625. Like, I've literally already got the bazaars points for the enchantment room. Let's go. How do I get out of here? All right, that's enough telekinetic points. Let's go get the two others. And that's 124 pizzazz points for the fucking alchemy room. Just one more now. Okay, and that is my 120th graveyard point. I can now go buy these infinity shoes. Should we get ourselves some infinity shoes? We should confirm. There we go. 50 league points for wearing them. 42,675. Let's go put our eternal crystal on these bad boys. Let's put the eternal crystal on these bad boys. Okay, those are bandos boots. Let's put the eternal crystal on these bad boys. Proceed with infusion. And that is 125 league points, 42,800 right now. Wait, what the hell? Now there are two of them. Yeah, I'm just getting the ice barrage toss done for the fucking... Does that not work? Does that actually have to hit? I'm doing the ice barrage toss for the RD Elite Diary. Oh my god, bro, the absolute unit kills me back. That's hilarious. That is hilarious. Let's go finish the rest of that now. Okay, and that was a fishing trawler game done for five points. Literally haven't done that yet. Please give me some manta rays, man. Please. Let's go, let's go. Let's go. Okay, that's the elite toss done. Nice. Let's make some runite limbs. And then... Let's make a rune crossbow. Oh, how do you even do that? Oh, I need a use stock, bro. I need a use stock. Crossbow stock. This and that. This and that. And this is the RD Elite Diary done, correct? Yes, and that is 125 league points that comes with it, putting me at rank 5 with 42,930 points. Let's hit the relog. So I've actually been doing loads of normal and hard tops, duos and trios in between all of these clips that you guys are seeing. I've got over 35 KC, but to be honest, I haven't really been getting any drops apart from the Vernic I got. Not all of us can get a scythe on 2 KC, you know? So I am wondering if you guys still want me to include top clips, like just to show you guys that I'm doing them, even if nothing's really getting going on and I'm not getting any drops. Just let me know in the comments and I'll edit the videos like that in the future. Also, if you guys have any advice on how to stay up and not get tired during these long rides, let me know. I'm all ears. I could really do with some advice. Guys, that's it for today's video. I love the support you guys have been giving me. The comments section has been hilarious recently, and I don't expect anything different on today's video. Guys, just remember, a subscription goes a long way in getting my channel out there. So please double check that you are subbed. Love you guys loads. I will see you in the next video.